Sunday, just after noon, and I'm back from the gym. And it was a repeat of yesterday. Uh, well, sort of more. Um, there was 40 plus 2 minutes on the bike, level up, 1 to level 11, because it's a level 11 kind of day. Some of you will get that joke. <laughs> anyway, then there was five sets of ten reps on everything. So the press, yesterday I only did a few sets, I don't remember if it was two or three, but today that's up to five. And man, that's hard. But five sets of ten on the press on the legless, on the forward crunches, the side crunches, and the low pull. So that was a lot. Um, this morning I got up, I had a green juice and a couple of cups of tea. And I did some work in my therapy workbook before I went to the gym. And so I'm hungry, I tell ya. I was already thinking about what I was going to make when I was down there. <laughs> I was going to have a salad. We have plenty of spinach and arugula and an avocado that is finally ripe today. I've been waiting for that for days. And some beets and a little bit of chicken breast. And I think that will be a delicious salad. But yeah, it was a really good workout. It was an hour and a half which is pretty good considering all the reps. Um, I was a little sore this morning, which is from the press, I think, and the low pull. So everywhere around my upper torso, so shoulder blades and upper back, shoulders and chest. There's a little soreness all the way around, which is great. I haven't had a lot of soreness. I definitely feel it when I'm working on the machines doing the weights and on the bike too in my legs. But I haven't had a lot of like, oh, I'm sore. And I don't know how I feel about that. Like, I feel like I'm supposed to be sore because that shows you're working. But then I also feel like if I'm sore and I keep working, I might end up injured. So, and there's definitely a couple different mindsets about whether you should be sore and keep going or whether if you're not sore, if you're working hard enough. Um, and I don't know what I believe, but I believe I like to continue going. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I'm not going to break myself if I can avoid it. So anyway, and the scale is moving, so I think I'm working hard enough. Um, as long as that last set is really tough to finish, like today I had to split the last set into fives <laughs> because I'm starting to shake from the effort. And so I think I'm still pushing just fine. Um, but yeah, it's an hour and a half. It's pretty good time. I didn't take too long of breaks in between sets. I think it was okay and I feel good but I'm starving. So I'm gonna make myself a salad, take a shower, and then I have some plant seeds to plant, which is fun. So yeah, I'll see you later. Sunday night and it's after dinner so last we spoke I was just back from the gym in the meantime I have done a bunch of stuff I had a salad you saw that it was spinach and cabbage and an avocado a beet 
and a little dressing. The dressing is literally a tablespoon of mayonnaise with some seasoning that had Cholula and some 21 season salute from Trader Joe's watered down. Just because I don't have any dressing, I don't want to have a bunch of dressings in the house because then I eat too much of it. And it didn't, I never eat it until it's gone. They always go bad, so it's a waste. But, um, so yeah, so that was my lunch salad with a half a pear. And then I took a bath, soaked in the tub for a while. I never take baths, and I used to when I was younger. And so I thought, well... We have this big, we have a big tub here, and so I thought, oh, I'll soak in the tub, it'll be so relaxing, and I guess it was, but after a while I was like, what am I supposed to be doing? <laughs> so I got out, <laughs> and then I planted the seeds in the planters and the herbs, and you saw that. They're pretty boring now because they look like they're just soil, but I'm optimistic. And then I had to sweep up because there was dirt around from the soil adventures. I roasted a chicken for dinner. And uh, while that was roasting, I painted a chalkboard that I got. So I've been listening to all these podcasts and doing all this reading for my emotional health, along with my physical health. Um, And along the way, I'm always hearing these great quotes, inspirational quotes or motivational quotes or just interesting quotes that make you feel like you want to do whatever. Anyway, so I got that chalkboard on Amazon and just put it over to the little bar cart. And I got that chalk paint that is permanent until you wash it off. And so I I painted the chalkboard, which was just a nice, quiet, creative break. It's not fabulous. It's a chalkboard, but it's got a quote on it, the first of many. Um, And it washes easily just with wipes. So that's cool. And then we had dinner. So dinner was, um, I had a chicken thigh, roasted chicken thigh, and we had sautéed cabbage with mushrooms and spinach, and then croissants. So I baked two croissants, that's all. The rest of the dough is in the freezer where it belongs, where I can't just eat the croissants. But they were so good. And so I knew I was going to do that for dinner. And so I was careful with my nutrition all day. There were no snacks. Um, Because I really wanted that indulgence. And so I did not blow my calories on that croissant. But it was totally worth it. (laughs) Anyway, so now it's evening time. And we're relaxing. But yeah, it was a good day. It was a good weekend. Kind of well-rounded. Lots of running around yesterday and lots of stay-home day today. Even if there was actually quite a lot of chores, my body is pooped. I'll sleep good later. But I hope you guys had a good weekend, and we'll see you tomorrow.